You mentioned that Trump is kind of a wild card here. Who do you think is more unpredictable, Trump or Kim Jong-un? I think at this point, Trump is a lot more unpredictable than Kim Jong-un. Kim Jong-un is not unpredictable. He is a rational leader. Everything he has done so far is quite rational. Even the things that seem very ruthless, almost barbaric to us, like his killing of his uncle or assassinating his brother, half-brother, all of it has certain rational thinking behind it. His acceleration towards completing the nuclear program, there was a logic to it. Now even his turn to this symmetry and diplomacy has a logic to it because he thinks he has completed the program. Now he can focus on seeing what he can get out of the United States. So it all makes sense from Kim Jong-un's perspective. Uh, from President Trump's perspective, because he's looking for a win that he can say is a win, I'm concerned that he's going to agree to things that doesn't, you know, it is not really substantive or things that we shouldn't agree to. So to me, president is more of a wild card here. What can you say as advice to Trump as how he can walk away with a win? from this meeting. I'm not going to even remotely try to advise Trump. He's not going to listen to his own advisors, so I doubt that he's going to actually listen to Sue Terry. My only advice to President Trump would be please listen to his own advisors. Listen to Pompeo, listen to Mattis. I think his advisors are more clear-eyed about North Korea. I think that Trump's negotiating disadvantage is that everybody has figured out Trump quite well. It's not hard to deal with somebody like that, do a lot of praise, give him a lot of affirmation, make him feel really great, give him something that can, he can then tout as a success, whether it's truly a success or not, does not matter. And then you have now, you know, you, you have something. So if you figure that out, that's a, that's a negotiating leverage for your opponent. So I think the issue with President Trump is he's actually too transparent because we all know that he needs that success, he needs that praise, he needs that affirmation, and the world's leaders have figured this out.